Hi, Blake class. Hope everybody's okay. Guess what? You've got me again next year. We are going to be in year three daily class. I hope you're really excited. I'm really excited to be keeping you, every single one of you again. Um, it's not going to be long. It's going to go really quick. So it's going to go really quick. So, you know quite a bit about me already, which is good for you guys. Um, so, you know about Jessica and Holly and how Jessica's 12 and Holly's 11 and they fight and argue and how Fudge loves these custard creams. He still loves these custard creams. And um, he's just on a dog walk at the moment, actually. That's why it's nice and quiet in here. Um, yeah, and I'm gonna be teaching you guys next year. So excited, I'm going back into year three and what's the really nice thing is that I'm taking you with me. So that's all very exciting. I'm busy getting our classroom all um, organized and ready for when you arrive. I wanted to share with you one of my favorite books from when I was a little girl. Now I know all of you know about all my books from my, from my children because I get to read them to you in class and you can read them too and they're all still in class ready for us when we get back. But one of my books when I was probably around your age was The BFG by Roald Dahl. Now Roald Dahl's quite a famous author and there are lots and lots of amazing authors out but this is just one that stuck to mind and I used to love this book and I always wished I was Sophie riding around in the BFG's pockets and going to Buckingham Palace. Didn't like the bit about the ear, sitting in the ear, but definitely the pocket. I really loved that bit. So this is my favourite book. And I know lots of you have been doing some reading over the summer holidays and have fallen in love with different authors. We have got a challenge for you to do over the summer holidays and for you to bring it in and share with your class. I thought it would be a really nice idea for us all to start off um, September with a good chit chat about our favourite book. You are going to do it and it's called a diorama and it's a shoe box idea or any box can do, any box. Um, and it's like a really a bit more exciting book review. Now I'm going to show you some pictures that I've found. Now this one looks like Alice in Wonderland. So they have put lots of different images in there um, about Alice in Wonderland. So is this Alice in Wonderland? I think it is. So they've got the picture there and then they've put little bits and pieces in the box. And they've then written all about the different parts of the story. So they've written about the hat there and they've got the watch here and they've just done a little review about different parts of their favourite book. Um, so that's so much more interesting than just a, just a book review. I'm going to show you another one as well. Now this is called The World According to Humphrey. Now I've never read this one either. But this person here has put a little scene of their favourite part of the book. And then they've written their book review at the top on a piece of paper. Um, and they've typed it up actually, which is quite neat as well. And they've put all the little bits and pieces in um, that tells me what they enjoyed the most. So you can, it's entirely up to you, you can be as creative as you like about your book box but I thought it'd be a really nice idea um, and then we can put it on display I'll make sure there's a big area in daily class that we can put all our shoe boxes on display um, and then we can share them with each other um, so yeah that's what I'd like that's your summer holiday challenge in between having lots of fun of course so stay safe I will speak to you all really really soon and I can't wait to be your teacher again bye bye you threes